Well, as we've been talking about all week, a low pressure system is going to track along the east coast and bring the east coast a storm system over the weekend, and it will have impacts to western New York. This is the uh, impact threats that we know as of now. The timing on this is mainly going to be midnight tonight into about uh, early Sunday morning, and uh, there will be some moderate to heavy rain at times, and uh, there is the chance, and uh, the models have been trending uh, cooler uh, for uh, Saturday night, that there could be some wet snowflakes mixing in as well. And rain totals will probably range between one and one and a half inches. And snow totals on the highest elevations, probably around a half an inch to mainly about one and a half inches, that'll be on the highest hilltops. And there it is right here. The center of circulation is now in Tennessee, but you can see all the rain that is out to the east. You can kind of see that little spin. That's all related to that system. And that's going to be riding along the east coast over the weekend. And uh, we'll show you what it will do to western New York. So for today, chance for a light rain shower, nothing out of the ordinary here. But here we go into tonight and you can see the rain will start to overspread the region. And actually, as I play the model out, you can see that little spin in it that is related to that system. And as that colder air starts to filter in, it looks like that it will start to change over to snow as we go into Sunday morning. And again, the highest chance for accumulation is going to be right out here in Cattaraugus County, going out to Allegheny County, and then maybe right along the uh, Boston Hills uh, of the Southern tier as well. That'll be the best shot for any snow accumulation. Uh, out of that and that's something we will continue to fine tune throughout the day and over the weekend as well. Temps today will top out in the lower 50s right along the Lake Erie shoreline a bit warmer than it has been still below average but at least we're not into the 30s and the 40s that's the good news but it will be in the 40s further east you go because of more stubborn cloud cover and uh, so it will be held down just a little bit further out to the east chance for a light sprinkle but not a big deal. 40 degrees tomorrow there's that storm system Saturday through Sunday temperature still into the 40s at least not as chilly as night that's the good news. As we go into early next week, temperatures remain into the 40s, but oh boy, temperatures start to rise back into the 50s once again. Halloween, spooky mild at this point. At least it's not mild in the sense it's above average, but it's mild in the fact that that's warmer than where we have been, and a few rain showers for Wednesday and Thursday as well.